Hey, what's up tech fans? You guys all know the general rule of thumb is if you've got the extra cash, you always want to buy the biggest, baddest video card for your gaming experience that you can get your hands on. At this moment, that is the Pascal version of the Titan X. But what if you're one of those people who doesn't have just a bunch of money to throw at one of those cards? You know, they're like $1,200, $1,300. Maybe you get to use them for a grand, but still, they're a lot of money. Many people out there bought the GTX 1070. It was a great card. It performed well, had a good price point. Now, can two of these cards though, an SLI, totally kick ass against the Pascal version of the Titan X? Let's see. Hey folks, just a real quick note before we actually jump in and check out the test system and the benchmarks. We tested some games in DirectX 11 and DirectX 12 because we just weren't seeing any type of scaling at all in DX12. And that's gonna happen because not all games have caught up. And obviously there'll be some games that just don't scale at all in SLI. And that's just how it is. Real quick though, let's just check out the test system. We have an i7-6700K. We keep it on turbo mode running at 4.4 all the time. We also have an ASRock motherboard. This is the Z170, this is the overclocked version. We also have 16 gigabytes of G-Skills Ripjaw memory. We're also using Windows 10 and the latest drivers that were available at the time of this testing. With that said though, let's rock out and let's check out those benches to the benchmark song. So there you have it. You guys can see on when it scales well, SLI kicks ass and even beats the Pascal version of the Titan X in many games across the board. Obviously, not every game out there is going to scale, and that's one of the things why they say, you know, buy the absolute best card that you can if you have the money because you're gonna get the best performance. But when SLI works, it really kicks ass. And you guys can see in those games, it scales very, very well. Not everything in DirectX 12 has caught up, so we're not seeing great scaling across the board with that yet. But as drivers change and DX12 matures, I'm sure we're going to see much better results in SLI all the way across the board. So I'm Elric. You guys have been watching Tech of Tomorrow. Like usual, all the information about these cards will be down there below that like button. Hopefully you guys like this and you guys can see that two 1070s can definitely cripple the giant Goliath of the Titan X.